light. Did you know that life cannot exist without light? Nearly everything you use depends on light in some way. Light keeps us warm. It powers some of the things we use. It also helps our food grow. Without light, you would not be able to see the beautiful colors of a rainbow, a sunset, the moon in the night sky, or even see your way around. Light is a form of energy that we can see when it is reflected off the surface of an object. Light travels in something called waves. Light waves behave much like the waves in the ocean. However, light waves are much smaller. Some light waves are bigger than others, though. Different colors are determined by the size of the light wave. The light we see every day is called the visible spectrum. The visible spectrum makes up a tiny portion of the entire electromagnetic spectrum. In fact, Less than 1% of light is visible to our human eyes. There are far more parts of the spectrum that we cannot see. Ultraviolet light, or UV light, means light beyond violet. It is just out of visible range for human eyes. However, some animals and insects can see UV light. For example, it helps bees to see which part of the flower to pollinate. UV light helps reindeer see lichen a type of food that they eat. And scorpions glow under UV light. Pretty cool! Scientists, called forensic scientists, use ultraviolet light or a black light to help them see evidence otherwise not visible. If you ever seen a black light used, you may notice that things that are white look like they're glowing purple. And things suddenly appear on your skin and clothes that you couldn't see before. Light travels at a speed of 186,000 miles per second. It takes about 8 minutes for light from the sun, 93 million miles away, to reach the earth. Light is believed to travel faster than anything in the universe. Did you know that if you travel at the speed of light, in one second you would be able to orbit the earth seven and a half times? Light can travel through clear liquids, gases, and some solids, but not all. It can travel through some objects very easily, like air, water, and glass. If light can pass through an object easily, the object is called transparent or see-through. We can see light streaming through a window, but cannot see it coming through a wall. That's because a wall is opaque. Light bounces off an opaque object, or an opaque object reflects light. Cement, wood, or metal objects are examples of things that are opaque. Translucent objects, like a stained glass window, sunglasses, or wax paper, allow light to partially pass through them. Translucent objects cause light to bounce off and scatter in different directions. Even your hand is translucent. Next time you're out in the sun, hold your hand up to the light and watch how your fingers seem to glow. That's because light partially passes through the skin of your hand. Light usually travels in a straight line, but reflection occurs when light waves bounce off a surface. Without light reflection, we could not see things. For example, the light from a lamp helps a person see the words in a book. Without the lamp, the words in the book aren't visible. Have you ever wondered how the moon appears to be giving off light even though it's just a big rock? The light that you see on the moon isn't actually coming from the moon, but from the sun. The light of the sun reflects off the moon's surface, making it appear to be glowing. Refraction is another way that light waves can change. Bending or turning light changes its path. The curved lens of a magnifying glass spreads out light waves, making objects appear bigger than they are. This can also occur when light travels through water or other transparent objects. The direction and speed of the light changes. It can even appear like the light is bending. A triangular prism is an example of refraction. When light travels through the prism, it changes direction. Isaac Newton a famous scientist who lived in the 1600s learned that when sunlight hits a triangular glass prism, 
colors become visible. Those colors are red, orange, yellow, green, blue, indigo, and violet. Can you guess what those colors make? That's right! As a result of refraction and a glass prism, we can see a rainbow. When sunlight is refracted through raindrops, we can see rainbows in the sky. Even though light can move through certain things, it can also be blocked by opaque objects. Light can be blocked with the sun visor, umbrella, or by the moon during an eclipse. When light is blocked, it will cause a shadow of the blocked object to appear. That's why you can see the shadow of your body on the sidewalk. Light enables us to not only see but do many things. Light waves or energy from the sun can be turned into electricity, also known as solar power. The glasses you may wear are curved, which changes light waves and helps you see better. When light reflects off a mirror, you can see yourself. Plants grow by photosynthesis. They use the energy from sunlight to turn carbon dioxide, which is in our air, into food. Without light, you would not be able to see the beautiful colors of a rainbow, a sunset, the moon in the night sky, or even see your way around. Light has some incredible abilities. It even saved a famous astronaut's life once. Jim Lavelle piloted the Apollo 13 space shuttle. He also flew airplanes. Once, while flying over an ocean, his instruments quit working and he didn't know where the aircraft carrier was. He thought he might have to eject from his plane into the deep, dark ocean below him. Suddenly, the lights in his cockpit went out. He then saw a bright green trail of lights in the ocean. That trail was algae that had started to glow after a large ship passed over it. The ship's propellers created energy causing bioluminescence in the algae. Bioluminescence is light that causes a chemical reaction in a living organism making it glow. Jim Lavelle said the glowing lights created a path that led his plane back to the aircraft carrier and saved his life. No doubt about it, we could not live without light. Hope you had fun learning with us. Visit us at learnbright.org for thousands of free resources and turnkey solutions for teachers and homeschoolers.